Okay guys, so my kindergartner for today's two snacks is just a, you know, one of those fruit roll-ups. And then just like some club crackers and a little snack baggie. She loves these crackers, so I'm just gonna give her these two for snack today, nothing fancy. Um, and then obviously she has her water. She is having a smoothie and an Encrustable. We gave her some um, pieces of a cheesesteak. I just cut up a cheesesteak, a mozzarella cheesesteak, cut up in pieces over there. Um, and then I just got some fruit in here for her today. So again, just a pretty basic, simple lunch that you can throw together. I love these containers because as you can see, I can fit in the big compartment an encrustable and a smoothie. I could probably fit, could have fit the cheese stick in here, or I know I could have. I just put them over there. Um, because you know, she can eat her snack with this, or you know, whatever she wants to do, I just leave it up to her. Again, this is Kinder lunch and then Kinder snack. My third grader just has her thermos water bottle. Again, I promise it's not dirty. It's just she's put so many stickers on here. Um, and it's rubbed off like in her backpack, uh, like the dye from her uniform, like the blue. Um, so yeah, I, and I promise I wash it all the time. But anyways, she has her water bottle. And then she has just these cheese crackers for snack. I ordered her my third grader's lunch for today. They, I think they're having chimichangas. Um, I told her to try it. She would like it. I know that she would like it. So I just told her to try it for today. And then obviously I'll hear about it when, she, when I pick her up. Um, but yeah, that is third grade snack for today. Here is um, for snack today. My kindergartner is just having, you know, like some strawberries and some grapes inside of here. Nothing fancy. And then I pulled out our um, Pottery Barn lunchbox from last year um, because again when she just has snack you know obviously I don't have to use like a big old I don't have to use like a big lunchbox so again I just washed and she'll be using this one for her snack today um, and then with her fruit I just threw in some crackers don't mind my nail I actually broke it yesterday with her snack, I threw in these crackers, a cheesesteak, and then her fruit. And then again, she only has, she only needs two snacks, but I just went ahead and gave her an extra. Um, and then she'll be having lunch at school today. So here's her water bottle. I actually went ahead and bought her the matching one to this um, from Potty Barn Kids. I bought her the matching water bottle, and then I also bought her the next size. I think it's like the classic or the cold pack. I don't know. I bought the bigger lunch than this one because, again, you like you can't really fit much in here. Um, but I mean, it works when it's just snack. Like her bento fits in here. The um, easy lunchbox containers that I've always been showing you guys, it fits, but it's a tight fit. So I went ahead and bought the next size up. So, you know, she doesn't have to like struggle trying to push it in there. Um, again, it fits, but you know, I just bought it anyway. Um, so yeah, she just has her fruit for snack today. I'm just gonna close that up. And then here's her unicorn ice packs. Switch the bed in there. The ice pack is, I mean, the, um, let's put this under here. I don't know, y'all. I'll just be packing it like this because it's, I don't know. I just don't want it, like, warm, which I know it's not going to be, but that's snack for today. And for my third grader, I just cut some of this, you know, dollar roll that, you know, obviously Walmart makes these every, fresh every day. So I just cut a piece of this French roll. And put it in like a sandwich bag again she loves to eat just bread like this um so this is what she's requesting for a snack today that's a pretty good piece pretty good size for her and then she has her water bottle as well it's just in the dishwasher behind me um i was actually gonna make them finish this right now this morning it was in the fridge 
I don't know if it would even stick that little sip in the fridge, but um, so yeah, that's snack for today. Again, I don't have to make anything for third or kinder. Um, they're eating at school, and yeah. Okay guys, so for today, I actually don't have to do much today because um, both of my kids are eating at school. Um, today's Wednesday and they're having pizza. They have pizza every Wednesday, so, you know, obviously they're going to eat that at school, but all I have to do is basically provide snack today. And for my kinder, you know, obviously this is her water bottle. And then she has just some cheese crackers and a fruit roll up, you know, nothing fancy, nothing, you know special this are these are just the snacks that they chose for today and then my third grader you know wants the same her water bottle is actually filled right now with gatorade and she has that in the freezer so you know obviously she's going to take that and then refill it up with water at school but yeah this is snack option today and um i don't really need to film what they ate obviously for today because they're going to eat all their snack like i feel like they they always do but just letting you guys know, no lunch today. See you guys tomorrow. Okay, guys. So for today, my kindergartner for snack, um, she is getting just, you know, some strawberries and grapes as usual. And then I opened up one of the... And then I opened up one of these. I pretty much just opened it and just put them in there. Um, so she, she doesn't have to worry about like trying to open the bag by herself. Um, so I just stuffed, it only came with four in there. I thought it was supposed to come with five. I don't know, don't, don't these usually come with five? Um, but anyways, she only got four out of that pack. So I put her muffins in here and then her fruit will be in this container as well. She gets two snacks, so I'm actually treating this as two snacks. Um, so yeah, she's going to have that link for this container. All my containers and stuff will always be down below. And then for her lunch today, she just has, it's pretty simple today. She has a yogurt smoothie, her favorite juice, and then just some ham roll-ups, four in there, nothing's inside. They're just plain, you know slices of ham just rolled up a cheese stick a mozzarella cheese stick that i just cut up in pieces for her some clubhouse crackers and then she has slices of apple i've already put lemon on there slices of apple and then she can dip in her peanut butter which is in the middle and again this is for kindergarten today there's her lunch and here's her snack pretty simple um, you know, no complaints there. I'm pretty sure she'll eat all of that. And then for third grade, for my third grader, um, spring all her stuff over. For third grade, she will be having obviously the same juice. She has an applesauce, um, to go with her actual lunch. And then the kinder has a smoothie, so yogurt and applesauce. And then hers is pretty much the same. The only difference is the cracker. So again, she has ham roll-ups and then a cheese stick as well. Same fruit, little froggy in there. And then her cracker is those chicken biscuit crackers that she loves. Hers are the chicken biscuit ones. So I just, you know, put a few of those in there for her lunch today. Um, and then of course, obviously they both will have their water bottles. You know, that's evident. Um, so there's that for third grade. And again, here is her. Again, this is lunch for third grade. And, and here's her container at the top, easy lunch boxes. You know, again, I will have these linked below. I will just go here. There's that. And then I'm just gonna pack those. For my third grader for snack, she hasn't really asked me for anything specific. Oh, you know what? Hold on. And then for my third grader snack, my third grader snack, she'll be having just these cheese crackers. And again, they're water bottles, and I'm just about to pack them. Um, hopefully, I remember to show you guys what they actually ate. But yeah, here's lunch idea, another lunch idea. Um, 
for kindergarten and third grade so I actually already opened this but then I was like oh no I forgot to record but anyways I swear um, I didn't tamper with this at all so this is my third graders lunch today this is Amina's and as you can see if you can see Amina ate all of her lunch except for one of her ham roll ups so she did pretty good um, she brought back her ice packs and her spoon I just had it because again I was already opening these and then I was like oh no I'm supposed to be recording them um, I just had that Anyways, she brought back everything. Um, I had gave her the applesauce and all that good stuff. So she ate all of that. And then for Selena, she had her snack. She left two of the four muffins. So she ate two. And then she ate like a good... Yeah, let me open it. And for Selena, she ate like a good portion of these strawberries and grapes. And then she just ate two of those muffins for snack. So I guess she didn't really like consume her whole snack today but whatever she drank all of her water and stuff so she's fine um and then in her actual lunch oh here's that spoon <laughs> don't mind that mess y'all this is where i unpack her lunches and it's i have like a target pick or pickup order on the side and then it's just messy on the counter as usual but anyway she ate all of her ham roll-ups what did i give right here what did, I, what did you have right here um cheese dip cheese stick so she ate all of her cut up cheese stick and she did not she maybe ate like one apple um and then like maybe a couple crackers so she didn't really even eat her whole lunch but i mean, I mean she ate all of her cheese and stuff <clears throat> and yeah she did okay she came home and she ate so that's generally i feel like all kids are like that like they spend all day at school and then they just come home and eat. <laughs> so she's fine. She didn't finish it all, but I'm just showing you guys what she ate. And then she came back with those three ice packs that I packed today. Okay guys, so for lunch today, my third grader will be taking some chicken salad. Just whip that up real quick this morning. Um, some applesauce. Um, a treat of marshmallows. And again, oh, I always forget to stick the fork in. Hold on. Forget to stick these inside before I start recording. So anyways, she's having chicken salad, applesauce, a treat of marshmallows, usual fruit, and then these chicken biscuit crackers, these right here. She loves these, especially when I'm making chicken salad. So she loves to have those just to like scoop it and eat the cracker with the salad. Anyways, that's what she's having for lunch today. I don't have to make anything for my kindergartner because they're having quesadillas. And um, I don't know, my third grader just didn't want that. So this is what I'm making her um, for lunch today. And then she obviously has her water bottle as usual, a juice, and then a spoon for her applesauce, and then for her snack today. This is all she wanted, so. Third grade lunch. These are all, it's not dirty, I swear. It's just residue from stickers. I don't know why she, she just keeps sticking stickers on here. But yeah, this is third grade lunch. And then for Kinder, I'm throwing in a juice for her, her water bottle, muffin, or what are those? Little mini donuts. And then she will be having an apple as well. So pretty easy today, honestly. Well, I did get questions um, about like how I pack my kids' lunches. So normally I always put one like at the bottom. Um, you know, just like an ice pack. I got these unicorn, these cute little unicorn ice packs. Um, I got them off of Amazon. I'll link them down below. But basically what I do is I put one at the bottom and then I put in the actual lunch. Hard trying to do this with one hand. So then I put in the actual lunch. Um, it fits just fine. This is just like a regular lunch box from Target. Nothing fancy. Um, and then I throw in one to two more on top. Like this is already cold, but 
I throw in one to two more on top, you know, depending on what I'm packing. Um, so like if I had like a yogurt, my kids are playing over there. Um, if I had like a yogurt or something, I would throw in another one, um, maybe like stick it in here or like just on top as well, just to keep both the juice and the yogurt cool. So basically what I'm saying is like, I would throw in another one like this um, and then I'll put another one on top with like the little yogurt smoothies that you guys see me pack um, because those can't fit inside of here. So this is basically all that I do. Um, I'm actually gonna put this on top. And then her spoon, because again, she is having that chicken salad and apple sauce today, so there's that. Close it up, and she's good to go. This is for my third grader. And then her water, she has a water. But yeah, now she's good to go, so I'll close that. Package, everything stays cool, um, yeah. And then my Kinder, um, she doesn't really need anything, but I'm gonna pack hers in like a mini lunchbox here, I'll show you. I do have like this mini lunchbox. Um, it's just like a unicorn, small little mini lunchbox. I got this, I'm not sure. I have, I've had this for a while, but um, she doesn't really need one today, but since she's having a juice, like I'm throwing in a juice or snack, basically what I'm saying is like I'm gonna pack her snack in here. Um, and I'm gonna throw an ice pack. There's another one of those mini uh, unicorn ice packs throw that in there even though my uh, kindergartner is eating at school I am packing her a snack and this is her snack for today so okay guys so for lunch today my kindergartner will be having a just a, an accustomable and then our usual smoothies got a little fruit in there, just some bread grapes and some strawberries. And then I threw in her own treat. Um, basically, PB&J peanut butter, but I mean, I don't know, she loves peanut butter. So that's pretty much all that I came up with for kindergarten today. And then this container is again, those I don't know if you guys can see the easy lunch boxes. This is those containers. Um, last I checked, they were sold out, but Bento does have a dupe, so I'll have that link below. Um, if you know if these are still sold out, I'll have those other ones linked below. But again, they do say easy lunch boxes, um, and I've used it since my oldest was in preschool. Um, and again, it says easy lunch boxes. These are very easy for your kindergartner to open. A good size, I think. So yeah, that's her actual lunch today. And then she obviously has her water bottle. And then she has her juice as well. And then for her two snacks, these cheese crackers. And then a cream pie. Like a little mini one. Um, yes, I know, not the healthiest, but they're going to eat it, so they'll be okay. And then that is Kinder for today. And then I'll try to remember once I'm unpacking their lunch boxes to include that in this video. Um, and for today. And then my third grader will be having just a string cheese with the same exact smoothie, the kiwi smoothie. And then I went out and bought just like a package of pepperoni. So I put like some in there. And then she has her chicken crackers that she loves to eat. I was gonna try and go for like a Lunchable, like a Lunchable um, cracker stack. You know, like how you have the cracker, the cheese, and then like the meat on top, whether it's ham, turkey. But I was going to try to do that with pepperoni, but I don't actually have any um, sliced cheese that she likes. So I just went ahead and put this in there. We have deli cheese, um, but she does not like that cheese, so I'm not going to give her that. Again, pepperoni, her chicken crackers, and then she just has strawberries in the back there. 
There's her strawberries there. And then her two treats again, same old candies. Little Mexican candies. I don't know if it'll focus. I don't know. I'm trying to get it to focus. Okay, and then she has two of these candies that go just like right there in the center. Again, this is third grade. Third grade lunch. And then for her snack, she will be having just like a baggie of flaming hot Cheetos. She loves these. She loves hot stuff. So she wants those. And then of course she has her water bottle. And she has her juice as well. Get that out of the way. So here is third grade. And then again, kinder. Okay, so normally, I'm, I'm just going to do my kinders because her and she box is closest to me. Normally, um, I pack two to three ice packs per lunch. And that just depends on like what I'm packing. Like if I have a yogurt not inside of a container, then I'm packing three ice packs um, just to make sure that the juice is kept cold and the yogurt. Um, and normally, I just, so I just take one again here, our... Um, unicorn ice, ice packs let's take one of the ice packs place it at the bottom again our unicorn ice packs i'll have those linked below as well if you have a little girl um i take her lunch make sure that it's closed all the way put her lunch i put the ice pack on the colder end um i guess technically the strawberries are here but give me a sec I'll, I'll show you what I do um I put one at the bottom I put her juice inside this is actually already cold let's set that here throw in another ice pack for for example I'm just gonna sit that one there and then I'm gonna throw in another one here and again this is probably overkill but I don't know I just want their lunch to stay cold so I pack again two to three, and then as you can see, two of those unicorn ones fit just fine. And then I'm gonna zip it up for you. If I can do it with one hand, I don't know. Again, all of that fits just fine in my Kinder lunch. So that's basically how I pack both girls' lunch. Um, again, one at the bottom, one ice pack at the bottom, and then two to three on top, depending on what's on top. Hope that helps. Okay guys, so I'm gonna be showing you like uh, what they ate at school today. So this is my kindergartners. These are her two ice packs, still cold. Open up her lunch. Here's that one at the bottom. Um, so it looks like she did pretty good. She ate all of that. She ate all of her snacks and stuff, um, her juice and all that. Left a little fruit in there. And then she didn't even open her. Didn't even open this. But I mean, she did good. I ate all her snacks and stuff. And then my third graders is right here. Let's see if I can. <laughs> um, it's my third grader in the background. Um, my third graders. Let's see what she ate. There's why didn't you eat your yogurt or your um, cheese stick? I don't want that. You didn't want it? Huh, You've been, I don't know why she didn't eat these today, guys, but I mean, she ate everything else. You saw what I packed. Um, she had the strawberries there, um, the pepperoni candy, and then she had those crackers there, but I guess she did not want these two today, but whatever. They're still cold. They're not like super cold, but they're still good. I'm just gonna stick them back in the fridge. And that's what they ate today. Okay guys, I have to be really quick, but for today, my kindergartner is taking some more of those little turkey bite sausage. <laughs> I always mess this up. She's taking some of those turkey bites, a little serving of popcorn, just like some regular um, sea salt popcorn, fruit there cheese stick here a few animal she has like a few animal crackers there or animal cookies here some crackers this is all that my kinder is taking today for 
lunch and then obviously she has her juice and for her two snacks she requested just like a snack bag of goldfish i mean she requested a snack bag of doritos and then an oatmeal pie and of course she'll have a water bottle um and then that's it for kinder Um, I'm going to actually show you guys how the bent gold fits in the pottery barn bag. It's just a tight fit, but you know, whatever. And then my third grader is having some kiwi, some of these goldfish, the extra cheddar goldfish in there, focus, cheese stick, and then <laughs> don't mind the ham roll ups, but don't mind them. I know that they look silly because these two are longer. These are actually prepackaged. This is from the deli. So regardless, she's gonna eat it. Four pieces of ham, cheese, those crackers, and then her kiwi. And then for her lunch, obviously she has the same juice. And then for her snack, one of those little Debbie strawberry shortcake little treats. I don't know, that's what she wants. Um, Another thing, I actually ordered them lunch for today. Um, and at school, they're having a corn dog, but I guess they don't like corn dogs anymore. So I don't know. They're gonna, their teachers still give them the lunch that I already ordered so they can pick at that and then eat their lunch, um, you know, whatever they wanna do. But they all actually get two, two lunches today. So we'll see um, what they eat out of what I pack later i'll show you guys what they eat later and then again this is the easy lunch box container Just close that up and then i'm going to show you guys how this big bowl fits in this size pottery barn lunch box okay as you can see i'm actually on my tippy toes so you guys can get a better angle but as you can see it's pretty much a tight fit um but it fits you know like it, it still closes and everything i have two ice packs on the bottom there's one and then there's a white one there um so it fits again it's just a tight fit and i'm still waiting on the next size to come in the mail but yeah i'm still going for one top and her juice inside as well Again, it's an extremely tight fit, but it works pretty tight. I don't know. Oh, it's like a Freddy there, or you know, somebody's head there. But yeah, tight fit. And then I'm actually packing my husband's lunch as well, so. There's that. 